we've all seen the videos of people protesting in the city and many of those people happen to be millennials taking a stand and trying to bring awareness to the killing of George Floyd. How one Houston native and former University of Houston basketball player uses his platform as the founder of a t-shirt company to join the hashtag Houston stand up to raise awareness. People express themselves through clothes, you know what I mean? So especially shirts, you know, they speak a lot, you know, so I felt like going to that avenue at first, I, I didn't want to do it because it was sensitive and I didn't want it to be received wrong. Like I wanted to raise as much money as I can and donate it to where it needs to go. So far, Galen has $5,000 in proceeds and was going to initially donate everything to the Minnesota Freedom Fund. But after learning that they've exceeded their goal extensively, he decided he wants to go to a smaller charity. I just want this money to be useful. You know, me giving a couple thousand dollars to people who already have a 6.5.5 million over their goal, that's not really you know what I mean? That's not really helpful. Can you kind of describe what idea was going through your head when you designed the t-shirt? Make you a bit uncomfortable. Because uh, cause I asked my mom, I, I asked her to let me breathe. Is that is that too much? And then I realized I was like, you know, this we've taken too much, you know? So it's, it's I, I'm okay with it being uncomfortable. I actually really want a shirt. So I'm probably going to <laughs> hop on a link and order one after this, after we're done. <laughs> Thank you. Um, but what, there's people that are in support of, you know, trying to bring awareness and but what do you have to say to those that are just kind of sitting back and silence to not pick a side is picking the side of injustice like people are risking their lives their safety just to get fairness like, let me tell you this let me tell you the story I'm, let me tell you the story i'm outside shooting on my basketball goal and um there's a kid who lives probably three houses down he's four or five year old he's a black kid and he wants to go can i shoot the ball and i was like yeah come on man and then two Hispanic kids, they're walking on the sidewalk with their mom. He stopped, he was on, he walked over and he was like, hi, hi. And for some reason, I don't know why I expected this because what I've been seeing, I expected them to not acknowledge him. But they, they, hi, they did the same thing back. And it's just like, man, that was the most pure interaction I've ever seen in my life. So it's like, it just tells me that all this stuff, all this hatred, all that is, it's, it's a learned behavior. Mean